Yo, what's good with you guys? My name is Swaggy. I've been playing my NBA 2K since 2013, I want to say. I had no idea this game was coming out today. I thought it was coming out next week. Um, I'm kind of ecstatic, honestly. I love basketball. I love game time. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Blazers and 7. You didn't hear that from me, though. But for real, though, guys, let's get into the game. I can't believe we're here. We're playing my NBA 2K21. What? How is this? Like, think about it. They're, the draft hasn't even happened yet. Can you play this game? I'm going to sign into my PlayStation. I'll have to blur this out, but... And I failed to log in. I mean, 2K21's not even out. Wait, how do you play this game? What? Alright guys, so I guess there is no MindBA 2K21. It says that MindBA 2K20 will be offering events throughout the rest of the NBA playoffs, and then in MindBA 2K21, I guess something like farther game modes will not be there anymore. So, that's it. MindBA is over. There's no more in-game. Now, there's a cover athlete, Damian Lillard. He's on 2K21 current gen, and he's on MindBA 2K21. But that's for the, the face scan, the VC. There's no game. I can't believe it. I was, I was actually hyped. Like, I thought I was about to start playing my NBA. It would have been, been perfect because I'm getting kind of bored of Supercard. And then my NBA comes out right in the middle of the first round. But no, it's over. Now, uh, I disagree with it, honestly. Like, my NBA 2K could be a very good game. If you take just, if you just take Supercard and you put that into my NBA. Now, I know they don't have the funds. The WWE backs up Supercard, so, of course, they can do that. But if my NBA just had something similar to that, like half as good of it, it could be a functional game. Uh, my NBA, uh, I mean, it's it's just a it, like honestly, like the way the best way to describe it would be um, greedy, like money hungry. My NBA. I um, mean, it's sad to say, man, because uh, I grew up playing this game. Uh, the the first honestly, like the first mobile game that I ever really played was my NBA. I remember opening up a pack and pulling Kevin Durant Legendary in Study Hall and everyone around me was going crazy. I remember watching Will Upton and Young Gary Oak uh, and they inspired me to make videos. So without them, I wouldn't even really be making videos. Like I probably wouldn't even be really playing the game. So um, I wanted to help it. Like I really wanted to, to make videos. Like I know I probably say a lot of things about it, but at the end of the day, like I wanted to succeed. I wanted it to be a good game. I wanted it to be something that we can enjoy because my best, not my best, but like a lot of my memories come through gaming, mobile gaming, console gaming. Uh, I've met a lot of friends through there. So just to see this game be, be done is, is kind of heartbreaking, honestly. Like it's sad because, uh, I mean, it was such a big part of my childhood growing up. So um, that's crazy. Like, uh, I don't know, man. Like there's no more my NBA 2K. Part of me wants to download my NBA 2K20 and just play the rest of the events but like i i just don't think it's a good game i was i was hoping 2k21 would would have a lot more features and just be a better game so i guess that's it man you gotta let me know down below your thoughts on that uh i'm, I'm shocked like i figured like at the bare minimum we'd get a new game that just was a copy and paste um, I guess it would be, it's, it'd be like hypocritical of me to say that they should, if I'd, I'd want them to drop a copy and paste game. I think that if they were to drop a copy and paste game, it would be better off for them not to do it at all. Um, I mean, the game makes money though, but I guess they just don't want to bother with it during like COVID. They probably don't have many guys working on it, like events and stuff and design. So, I mean, it, if they think it's in their best interest, then, then it's whatever. But, um, that's it guys. There's no more mind BA 2k. Um, uh, I'm going to get this video out, guys. Uh, I hope you have a great rest of your day.